Jack and Joan have had a wonderful life. After all these years, Joan still loves Jack. But these days, Jack's disappointing Joan. See, Jack's got a problem with a part of his body that we can't talk about on TV. So we use metaphors. When we show Jack having balloon trouble, he's not really having balloon trouble. No one has balloon trouble. The balloon is just representing, you know, the other thing. Get it? Jack's train is not derailing. Jack doesn't have a train. Who has a train? The train represents, well, you know what the train represents. Get it? There's good news for Jack. At Eli Lilly, we have a solution for his problem. Introducing Metaphorica, the medication for the treatment for the part of the body that we're not allowed to talk about on television, dysfunction. Get it? With Metaphorica, Jack's balloon will stay inflated for up to 36 hours. Get it? With Metaphorica, that train, which is not really a train, will go in and out of that tunnel, which is not really a tunnel, all night long. Joan will be satisfied when Jack finally pulls out of her station in the morning. There is no station. Women don't have stations. That's a metaphor for her. Look, with Metaphorica, Jack's hot dog will go perfectly with Joan's donut. Okay? Jack's missile will hit Joan's target. Get it? Do you get it? If you're a guy who's got balloon or train or plunger problems, ask your doctor about Metaphorica. You should get it so she can get it. Oh, and when you do get it, her like there is no tomorrow. Get it?